this what they say. And we always be like, who the hell is they? We don't know who they is. You, you know what I'm saying? Shout out to S. Cal S. Cal Damn it, I finna say S. Caliber. Shout out to R. Escobar for the, for the, for the, for the $10 cash out. Say shout out to all the monkeys leaking Gorilla Glue. STD Friday. That's what's up. <laughs> leaking Gorilla Glue. That monkey doing his thing because it leaked like thick leak. Is it? Y'all don't even worry about it. You had to be there. You have to be there to really understand what we're talking about. Gorilla Glue leaking. It take a good little minute for... My condolences for you babies who not Gorilla Glue. Don't need much word about it. Look here. who They say a driver. A driver. A driver. A person of a car is a driver. A driver said that she knew the woman who was pointing the gun at her in Houston. In the road. Listen to this story. Oh, it seems Daniela, the apparent victim in this case, says it was not road rage. Instead, jealousy that escalated to violence. Jealousy. And the first thing I thought about was my kids. Alicia Hagen says she knows exactly who pulled guns out on her at the intersection of Gessner and Hempstead. She says it's her friend's ex-girlfriend and the woman's mother. She says the woman had been harassing her all Tuesday morning. I was confused. I didn't know what was going on. So like a, a couple hours went by. He called me from his phone and was like, she's tripping, she's doing the most, uh, she's mad, and we became close. Hagen says since befriending the man, the woman- She mad because y'all became close. <laughs> what do we call close? Really, really good friends? And won't leave her alone. Call me every day. I block her number. She called me 69 times. 69 times. This is a funny, that's a funny number, right? 69 times, but go ahead. But Tuesday night, Hagen says things became violent. She called her mom and made it like I said something about her daughter, and I never said anything, so the mom believed it. And um, I had just dropped him off to his mom's house. Coming back when y'all seen that video. This is video captured by a witness. Hagen says it shows the woman and her mother driving erratically in a red Dodge Challenger, cutting off her Jeep. She says the woman's young child was also in the car. Sitting at the light, I seen them doing gestures. She had called me to, to make sure it was me. My truck is very noticeable. Then she says the woman and her mother got out of the car and the woman's mother was armed. She walked back and she was like, uh, went and got another gun. So it's not just one, it's two. And she's aiming them both at me like this. Hagen says she feared for her and her children's lives. And my six year old daughter's in the, in the back seat. Mommy, why is that lady in front of our car, our car with that gun? <laughs> About that meat. That's why that lady in front of you got that. That's exactly what you should have told your, your child. About that meat. And I sat there for about two minutes. And I guess they noticed that I wasn't getting out, so they sped off. Tonight, still shaking. She's hoping justice prevails. That's that monkey on monkey domestic love. There it is. I was scared. I really thought my life was over. Me too. Hagen says the woman is still terrorizing and stalking her, circling her block on a regular basis in that red challenger. The HPD Major Assaults Division is investigating, and Hagen says she plans to file protective orders. Reporting live on the North. I done told y'all players. That's it. Let me come up a little bit closer. I done told y'all players. That's it. Right there, right there, y'all, y'all doing this shit here? Uh-uh, nope. That's getting your little home girl with guns pulled out on her. Listen, in my mind, y'all already hunched. Hell, ain't in the dude ex girlfriend mind, y'all already hunching. You call it that y'all, y'all done got closer. It, damn it, in my mind, we know what getting closer is. We getting closer. We Together, we, uh, we hunching. We making these sounds. <sighs> Is that why you about to get your brain, your brains blowed off? That boy probably done in that baby. What, am I, what, what is you doing riding around with him? You can't do that. Shout out to Deshaun for the, for the, for the $10 cash out. Say salute, play boy in the chat. Happy STD Friday. Appreciate that right there. That baby say, 
I was in fear for my life. Yeah, despite how it seems, Daniela, the apparent victim in this case, says it was not road rage. Instead, jealousy that escalated to violence. Marching backs, yeah. And the first thing I thought about was my kids. <laughs> we be lying. <laughs> we be lying, but we got to give our respect for trying, baby. Back you up a smidgen. I ain't going to just do you like that, baby. Shout out to Esther for the, for the, for the $2 cash out. Say, I love how you put emphasis on big word. I appreciate that right now. Look, look, look. That escalated to violence. Look, look, look. look, look. And the first thing I thought about was my kids. <laughs> Alicia. <laughs> no, you didn't. You thought about what? Well, damn, she going to shoot me about that meat? <sighs> Where was your gun? You slacking. You let somebody cut you off like in a movie, bitch. <laughs> if somebody, listen to all you. If somebody cut y'all off, bag out the game. But then, listen, we also got to think about this right Yeah, yeah, yeah. Where's the tip? Baby, around right here at the Willow Weaver Show, we point out when y'all be talking about the closest thing to y'all got them hard, which is typically your kids or your mom and them and shit like that right there, and y'all don't be crying like we... What about my kids? <laughs> Not now, till. And then you're going to grab, grab your face, but you're going to put a finger here and a finger here and squeeze in to make the little moistness turn into a tear. I know what the fuck I'm talking about. I did that before. But look at him. Her mama was driving the car. She was on the passenger side. Well, no, 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 no. That's her mama. Pull the gun out. This the ex, the little slim thick. That's her mama with the gun out. What? I'm so good. Listen, why do y'all think the mama would have pulled the gun out? Cutting off her Jeep. She says the woman's young child was also in the car. Sitting at the light, I seen them doing gestures. She had called. Thank you. Mama was hunching too. Called me to, to make sure it was me. My truck is very noticeable. Then she says the woman and her mother got out of the car, and the woman's mother. Yeah, little slim. It's somebody them got them shorts, though, right there. When you're sitting down. That's them loose jogging shorts. I think that they are right there. Little the woman and her mother got out of the car, and the woman's mother. See, because when you sit down, they slide up, and then when you step out, they got to slide back down. I'm just pointing out something. Then she says the woman and her mother got out of the car, and the woman's mother was on. They slide all up in your monkey. I'm just. I'm just being observed. She walked back and she was like, uh, went and got another gun. So it's not just one, it's two. And she's aiming them both at me like this. Hagen says she feared for her and her children's lives. I still don't know how to slow down the damn, um, uh, uh, um, thing. I still don't know how to slow down the chat. Can somebody please explain it to me? And my six-year-old daughter's in the, in the back seat. Mommy, why is that lady in front of our, our car with that gun? And I, I sat there been, for Because I have been hunching her ex-boyfriend. That's what you should have told your daughter. Mama, why this woman in front of your car with a gun? Because I've been hunching her ex. And we supposed to just be friends? I think that friends should hunch. That's what make you a good friend. When you is in need for another, you got a friend, you should be able to hunt your friend. Just in my mind. I, I know, I know, I know. I'm different. But listen, baby, I don't know if you want to ride back over to Buddy House and shit because she's still stalking. She's still coming around, still calling your phone 69 times or whatever she's doing out here in the goddamn street. Baby, you better stay away. Listen, it's probably best you go on like a week vacation or something like that. Hell, you might want to get your number changed, sugar, because if she catch you, if she catch you around now, if she catch you round there, round that meat, one more again. She gave you a warning. You cannot say she did not give you a warning. You say, Willie, did she start off saying that she called, she called from his phone also? No, 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 I don't, oh, no, 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 no. Wait, wait, wait. I don't think so. I don't think she did that. Hold on. I thought about was my kid. Girl, stop. Alicia Hagen says she knows exactly who pulled guns out on her at the intersection of Gessner and Hempstead. She says it's her friend's ex-girlfriend and the woman's mother. She says the woman had been harassing her all Tuesday morning. I was confused. I didn't know what was going on. 
So like a, a couple hours went by, he called me from his phone and was like, she's tripping, she's okay. doing the most. Uh. He called from his phone. That's what's up. Shout out to S to to R Escobar for the for the for, for the two dollar cash. I'm say, I'm say gotta stop looking these babies in the eyes too. I'm trying to listen. We connect with the eyes. You cannot stare, especially while you rubbing on the baby, or just some just you connecting so good she feel like you rubbing on it. That me the eye contact, bitch. I'm trying she's to mad and we became close. Hagen says since befriending the man, the woman won't leave her alone. Call me every day. I block her number. She called me 69 times. But Tuesday night, that baby called you 69 times. Shout out to Richard D for the for the for the two dollar cash shop. You say what Johnny T say? Say my last two dollars. That's what's up. I appreciate that right there. Yes, I do. Yes, I do. But y'all looking good with these numbers, but they can look better. Y'all is doing excellent, but y'all can do better. We need 500. Hagen though. says things became violent. She called her mom and made it like I said something about her daughter. You did say something about a goddamn dog. It is what it is. I don't know, in my opinion. It is. But hey, hey listen. Listen, sugar. I'm here to help. And I'm listen. Y'all can be friends on the internet. Hell, yeah, whoa, whoa, whoa. You can't be friends on the internet either because, damn it, it'll trace back to you. Y'all got the light hell. Like, when you see them in the store, you damn near don't even much want to speak. I'm just saying, just stay from around there for, a, like, a good little minute. Just stay from around there for a good little minute. Or, hell, shit, something better. Next time she call you, answer the phone. Tell her what hell. Baby, we can both be with them. Since y'all done got close. I'm just saying. Moving right along. I ain't need much going on.